Good afternoon, this is Todd Colvin coming to you from the floor of the CME Group. We are talking metals and gold, seeing a breakout move back above 1300. Not too long ago, we were trading here and the market sort of collapsed on itself. We saw, we saw longs get out, we saw prices decline very quickly. We went from 1300 down to 1270 and it looked like we were gonna sit there and then we saw stage two of the sell-off take us down to about 1238. So that move looked like everybody had gotten out. It looked like anyone that bought high really sold low and kind of really just ended the year on a sour note. But lo and behold, We've seen gold really make a remarkable rally here. We traded from the lows, 12, uh, high 1230s, up to 1270 pretty quickly, and the market looked to maybe consolidate there heading into year end, and that didn't happen. We saw another big move up to these recent highs. So right now, gold seeing some pretty wide moves, uh, albeit ending on the recent highs, and it looks like gold is going to end the year on some very positive momentum. Now, it did get helped by the dollar. The dollar has continued to sink here. We've seen the dollar decline pretty much all year, but it did have some moments there over the last few months where we did see some upticks. It looked like maybe with Washington getting its act together, with the Federal Reserve getting back in order, uh, raising rates that possibly the dollar was going to be uh, an obstacle for gold prices to go higher, and it really wasn't, and it was short-lived. So the dollar heading lower as gold prices go higher, and I think as we move forward here, the positioning is going to be key because a lot of the speculators exited the market on that uh, aforementioned move from 1300 down to 1238. So they got out, now they're getting back in, and they're probably chasing it to move it higher. So speculators, I think, are going to be behind a lot of this rally, especially on the highs, because the momentum has shifted so much. So speculators chasing to get back in. Gold prices seeing a breakout move into year end. Uh, next up, we'll have the Fed minutes next week in the first week of the year, followed by employment. And don't forget that January FOMC meeting, which will be Janny Ellen's last. All will have pretty big effects on gold pricing. This is Todd Colvin coming to you from the floor of the CME Group.